Do you find that sometimes your Facebook ads work great and sometimes they don't? Hey, what's up, everybody? I've been talking about um, content for a while and uh, a pretty big focus on video content, but let's take a break from that for a minute and talk about Facebook advertising. That, that, should, be, that should be a big part of your marketing plans um, to run campaigns, not just ads, but full-on campaigns um, to let people know who you are, offer them something, generate some leads, and then work them through your sales funnel. So, um, but that's what, that's, that whole plan is not what this is about. This is specifically about uh, targeting on, on, um, on the Facebook ad platform. So, in an ad set, if you're familiar with the ad platform, you have uh, campaigns, ad sets, and ads. Um, campaigns are your overall campaign. Then you can have multiple ad sets in a campaign, and you can have uh, multiple ads within an ad set. Um, so let's just keep it simple and not talk about all the multiplicities of that. Is that the right word? <laughs> um, why is this person going so slow? Man. Um, so anyway, in your ad sets is where you'll set your targeting. And often what happens is uh, people will, you know, they're looking to reach new audiences or, or whatever the, that they don't already have built, audiences built. So you're looking to reach a new audience and you're reaching out to interest level. Um, as part of the targeting that you can do is on interest level and you should absolutely do that. So if you're looking for those new, new audiences, you'll oftentimes select multiple interest levels. And um, that gives you a hit and miss strategy. One of those interests, uh, interest targeting might be exactly what you need for your ad. One of them might not. But you're not gonna know which, which one is doing which. Um, and depending on your, your campaign objective, you're going to run this ad and not know exactly what failed or what gave you the result if you have multiple interest levels on one ad set. So the best thing for you to do is um, during your testing, because you're reaching new audiences and you need to test this. So um, during your testing, create an ad set with one, one interest level targeting, one set of targeting rules. Um, and then if you want to try out another one, create a separate ad set within that same, same campaign that includes your other targeting. And that way, uh, your budget will be split, you know, split your budget because you're setting your budget at the ad set level. So, or you can, you can set what you want to spend on a particular ad set. So just split it across those ad sets. And um, then you'll know that this ad set performed in this way and the other ad set performed in the other way. And those ad sets will have different targeting options on them. So that brings you down to the targeting. You'll know which targeting worked. Keep everything else exactly the same so that you don't have variations in your ad copy and your ad creative and all that kind of stuff. Run the same ad in each ad set and that way you can test different interests, interest targeting um, in different ad sets and know which one works and which one doesn't what's happening on your, on your multiple, when you're using multiple interests in one ad set is that it's kind of a hit and miss. Sometimes it'll get around to the right set of people and, uh, but if Facebook starts showing it to the other, the wrong set of people first, it'll, uh, it'll degrade your ad and that way the right people won't see it exactly right. Um, conversely, it might show it to the right people first, and so that's the interest level that, that you should be targeting. 
Um, but it'll be brought down a little bit by the by the other interests that isn't the exact right targeting for you. So anyway, to get around all of that and to know exactly what you're doing and exactly what numbers you're looking at, then separate your interests when you're targeting into separate ad sets. <laughs> Is that sufficiently confusing enough for you? If you're familiar with the Facebook ad platform, you know exactly what I'm talking about. If you're not familiar with it, you need somebody to help you out. I can help you. Anyway, go try that stuff, and I'll see you on the next one. I'm out.